Hey guys, welcome to another video. And today, I'm going to show you how to make a fake virus on your USB. Please note, it is illegal to put this into anybody's computer without their permission. But you can leave it laying around for them to pick up and put it into their own computer. get straight into it. First you are going to want to format your USB to get everything off of it. If you have any important information on it though, be sure to back it up so it's not lost. To format it, you're just going to want to go to your USB or the driver and files right here where I am and you're going to want to right click on it and right here should be format. You're going to want to click on it and click start. A warning sign is going to pop up, but you're just going to click OK because it's just telling you it's going to erase everything on it, and you know that already. Then you're going to click OK, and bam, your USB is now squeaky clean. Now you are going to go back into your USB and create a new file. You're going to want to put a name on the folder that is like something that they would want to click on. So I'm going to name mine Secret. So, right here, and you can name your something like free food or something, or something that will make them want to click on it. So, after you do that, you want to go to notepad, and you're going to want to type this in, color space A, echo space, and right here could be anything you want. You can type out anything. This is what's going to show up as your word or so-called virus. I put, your computer has found a total of 23 new viruses and has a total of 36 viruses. If this is not fixed after the next 24 hours, your computer may no longer work. And then, after whatever you want to put, you're going to put pause. After you put all this, you're going to want to go to file and click save as. You're going to want to save it into the folder you just made on your USB. So right here, I'm going to click on it and click save. But before you save it, you're going to want to save it as a dot .dat file. If it's saved as a .txt file, it will not work. So after you put .bat, you're going to click save. X out of your notepad and go back to your um, USB. Click on the secret and then click on it. It should pop up like right here. Now you're going to want to go back to the main menu of your USB and you're going to right click and click go to new and shortcut. You're going to make this shortcut go all the way back to that new fake virus thing you made from the notepad. So we're going to find it somewhere. Right here. Then you're going to want to click on it. Then you're going to want to go to secret and click on your .bat file. You're going to click OK click next and then you're going to name this. This is where you want to stick your sketchy name or the name you want to put for them to click on that will make them want to click on it. For me I'm going to click secret again then finish it. Once that is there you're going to want to right click on this folder the secret one you made first and go to properties. You're going to want to check hidden and click apply ok then click ok and it should be hidden now. Once you do that, you're going to want to right click on the last one, your .bat file. Go to properties and click on change icon. You're going to click OK and you're going to change the icon to a folder, like right here, where you can click on that one. Click OK, apply, and OK. Now it doesn't look so obvious as it's a script that's going to act like it's a virus. It looks like a normal folder. So now you have a fake virus on your USB, lay it down for your friends to pick up and let the fun begin. Good luck at keeping a straight face.
Thanks for watching. Please subscribe and like if you liked the video, and down in the comment section, please tell me what you'd like to see next. Till next time.